Hi Alex, greetings from Croatia. Hope you're doing fine. Okay, let me try and be fast with this screencast. I'll try to be as brief as I can. Okay, first I'll try to explain what does the application do. First I did set up uh, the environment exactly like you have the Magento version 1.4.1.1 and I have set it up two text rates I have I have two two text rates with 25 and 8 percent and I've made some demo products with that with that mixed with that two types of uh, text text and I've made some orders with mixed uh, with not mixed uh, let me see again I'll try to zoom in a little for you to see easier. Uh, I have some orders and some memos, uh, credit memos for with mixed order, with mixed products. Okay, so the application does this breakdown of orders with mixed uh, 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 here. Uh, this is your, uh, so this is my demo site and application is positioned here with the text folder just only uh, this is basically the folder and uh, we have to use the username password and path that we can get from our Magento you can define them here I did define mine uh, username uh, with uh, my app user and I gave him the role admin which you do not need I mean you can just give him the the sales permission and that's about enough I think okay I did I did created my username with my password and the path is your path of your web shop of your website with this extension behind index index php rp xml rpc okay uh, order status uh, we can choose what we what we want you can choose uh, i think you you want complete orders and closed orders the closed one are credit memos and complete let's see what we have when i choose complete orders we have breakdown of one to three orders by every product which has different percentage for tax and the timeline of that order uh, okay we export the data into csv so we can try to aggregate it something like excel I, I guess you'll try to, to use Excel because it's convenient for you or maybe maybe you can uh, import and manipulate this data in in some way for your product pro program uh, let's try to see by order and by net total and text and maybe product name and so we can get our free orders by tax and uh, net total and whole breakdown I, th I guess you'll try to use something like that so the basically you can uh, choose your credit memos or your complete or your pending so you can define your uh, criteria here and just get CSV and you're done basically this is it for the installation purposes this is base this is simply just one folder as I've mentioned so you can place them in your root for your web shop and inside is just one couple of folders with JavaScript CSS and images and the permissions for the application are just to read the data from your uh, from your uh, API setup okay that's it hope you see you soon bye